Now a GMA health alert. Could your hot cup of coffee or tea be linked to cancer? A new study may make you pause before you take that first sip. Dr. Jen is back, so tell yeah. us about the study. Let's get right into it, Robin. All this right. was a very large study. It appeared in the Annals of Internal Medicine. It was done in China, followed a lot of people for almost 10 years, found that people who drank at least one hot cup of tea a day, if they drank and smoked as well, had a huge increase in their risk of esophageal cancer. Now, here are the caveats. Number one, this study was done on association, not causation. That's the first okay. thing. And I think it's also important to remember that hot is different to different people, and they did not measure the exact temperature. They didn't put a thermometer in a cup of hot what tea. What is it about the temperature that could possibly trigger cancer? Well, this has been controversial in the world of oncology for a while, this concept of thermal injury. Mm -hmm. So something that's very hot, whether it's from a burn or whether it's from a beverage, can potentially damage a cell's DNA. But we also need to remember that when you're talking about esophageal cancer, there are other known risk factors, high alcohol consumption, smoking, obesity, what we call GE reflux or heartburn that can lead to a condition called Barrett's esophagus. Those are all known risk factors. This right now is just association. So how hot, hot is the average morning drink? All right, well, listen, this is where common sense prevails. Yeah. If it is so hot you can't touch the cup, right. you probably shouldn't be putting that cup to your lips. If you take a sip and it burns your tongue, let it cool off. And the temperature here that has been associated with a possible increased risk is 149 degrees Ooh. Fahrenheit. Most of us, and you know, I love my coffee, but, are drinking beverages way below that. Yes. So don't worry. Okay. I, I love the expression of that man. He was like, well, 149. But, I, but I think Robin, I'm good. if you put your hand on this, right. cup, it's hot. It is hot. All right? right. So if it's so hot you can't pick it up, then you shouldn't be drinking it. Okay. It's real common sense. Yeah. All right. As always, Jen, thank you. For, you how's bet. it going with water? Um, the drink I am hydrated like I you know. can't imagine. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Yeah, we've, How are you we've, doing? Yeah, I'm, that, that, the side effect it of drinking. It cuts into the day. Yeah, I know what you mean. Does, but, but I feel better. Yes. I feel better. So I, can I. I can already see the effects. And we're getting lots of great comments All on right. social media. All right, Jen, thank you very you much. Bet. And uh, by the way, caffeine dehydrates oh, you. Oh, so yes, it does. All right, just put it all together there. <laughs> Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.